This Liberty Sports Update is brought to you by Beacon Credit Union. It's been all right. It's uh, the energy level still there. The uh, All the uh, other coaches have been doing a good job of making sure we're doing the right thing, uh, keeping locked in and keeping the energy up during practice and not uh, letting that be a distraction for us. The coordinators, how vital have they been in making sure everything still goes goes to plan and make sure you guys don't get off sequence at all? Uh, they've, they've been a big part in that, uh, just making sure that uh, when we mess up, we re run the play back and we have to do it again and make sure we're all doing five for five on the offensive line, especially. Uh, they're making sure that we're taking care of each other, not doing stupid stuff on the field, uh, and just making sure that we keep our energy up and we're not uh, playing lackadaisical. Have you guys heard from Coach Free since the back spasms, and what was his message to you if you have? Uh, no, we haven't haven't heard from him, but uh, the other day we did send him a message. Uh, tougher together, we love you, Coach. So I hope he's doing all right. You look at the offense. <laughs> what was that again? Oh. Oh yeah. Yeah, I think uh, at the hospital he's uh, he's eager to get back. I bet he's still watching the, all the film and making sure that we're uh, doing the right stuff and getting ready for Syracuse. But I def, I bet he's very eager to get back. Yeah, coming in my first year. Uh, when I redshirted by the end of the year uh, versus Coastal Carolina, we only had five guys that were that could play, and now we have at least ten guys that are ready to go that could play. Uh, just some of the younger guys are definitely stepping up into that role and learning the offense, especially uh, since the spring. Uh, but we definitely have a lot more talent than we have in the past. You look at the, I guess, what would be the starting five. There's a lot of experience up there. How much have you guys been? really honing in on making sure you guys get better and also elevate the guys behind you? For, uh, for the first thing, we're definitely pushing each other. Uh, when we're out there, someone gets something wrong, we'll make sure they know what to do right. Um, we're just making sure that, especially the younger guys, when they get in, they mess something up. We'll make sure they do it right. And then watching film, we all make sure that just everybody is technique sound. And then once they do that, they can execute the play. Last year, like there are games like EVA where you guys could run the ball at will, uh, other games where you guys could throw the ball at will. What's been the key for you guys finding the balance to make sure you guys are as sound in run protection as you are in pass protection? Uh, just keeping our assignment and our technique, uh, just making sure that on every play we have all of our assignments. We're five for five on the offensive line and we're uh, doing all the technique right. We're getting all the right calls out, uh, just doing everything right. Uh, definitely learning the, uh, some of the new offense. Uh, from last year, we have to do a lot more technique. Uh, it's, it's different. Uh, we definitely, in the spring, we got, uh, that was a kind of acclimation period for us to get to know the playbook and get used to the uh, offense. And now we're kind of putting that into practice. We're, we're doing plays correctly, whereas in the spring, we'll have assignment and technique errors. But now we're, we're getting better.